Uh, let's go to the phones. You're calling from a 951 area code. Who is this? Hey, it's me, David Turian. Just give me a second. I need to show off my YouTube feed so you don't want to get some There. Okay, I'm here. Um, I just wanted to say, like, uh, one more thing about burning your bus, and I know you're sick of talking about this, but um, I thought I'd make a good point, and that is that, um, again, Jill Stein is a member of the Green Party. Don't vote for Jill Stein. In the Green Party platform, it says this. Green support a wide range of health care services, not just traditional medicine, uh, blah, 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 surgical techniques and cost. Oh, basically, they're against uh, regular medicine. They said wow. chronic conditions are often best cured. Yeah, chronic conditions are often best cured by alternative medicine. We support the teaching, funding, and practice of holistic health approaches and, as appropriate, the use of complementary and alternative therapies such as Herbal medicines, homeopathy, naturopathy, traditional Chinese medicine, and other healing approaches. I mean, uh, look, there are things in every platform that I uh, disagree with, I'm sure. I didn't, you know, uh, last year, 2012, uh, the, 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 there was a, a horror. I can't remember what exactly it was, the platform piece about Israel, but I'm sure that there's, there's things in everybody's platform. I don't know that that means that they don't believe in medicine. Uh, it just may mean that they believe. No, in, no, 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 no. This they, is they, John they're Mellon. not against all medicine. <laughs> they're not against all me medicine. They're just saying that they support, um, like they specifically say homeopathy. Well, homeop uh, homeopathy is a bunk. I, it's not even science. It's literally just diluting water. It's a joke, and it should not be funded by my tax dollars. It's it's, it's embarrassing. Homeopathy brought platform. me back to life. Oh, excuse me, it brought him back to life. This is John Miller. <laughs> All right. Well, I mean, look, it's uh, it's, it's definitely a um, uh, a point. I I tend to agree with you when it comes to homeopathy. He was resurrected. I appreciate by a small call. sugar. Thanks, one, one more. What's that? Can I get one more thing? One more thing. Um, just one more thing. Um. This, like I said, there's like seven different like social, socialists and liberal parties, and I won't read the whole list. Just Google it. Um, there's so many. It's literally throwing away your vote. So what I'm going to do is because I made a promise to a friend of mine who was basically one of these Bernie or Busters who was just giving me so much crap vote about swapping. voting for saying I would vote for Hillary. Your vote yeah. swapping. And so I... I yeah. All right, but David, so, it's, it's, yeah, it's premature for this. It's premature and, for this. I appreciate the call, but I, but I, I honestly I don't want to talk about it. Okay, I don't know. But vote for Vermin Supreme. Vermin Supreme, throw away your vote. A vote for Vermin Supreme is a vote wasted. Bye. Okay. Bye. I don't know what that means, but um, uh, let's you let's play this. You all are really freaking out, aren't you? Because <laughs> Donald Trump is going to restore this country. He's going to bring us back. He's going to renew us again, and all of the liberals, all of the leftists, everyone who's wanted to teach your children that they could be a fire truck or a homo <laughs> or whatever, all of the ones who want to I'm sorry, destroy. did you say fire truck or a homo? A fire truck, a homo, a he, she, boy, boy to she, to boy, to truck, to plane, whatever, as long as they are sensitive about it and you want to take away ethnic night and everything is a safe space, you're really butthurt right now because Donald <laughs> Trump is going to come in and we're going to build airplanes and we're going to build cars and we're going to make great deals and the economy is going to grow again and black people will return to the back of the bus. <laughs> it's going to be tremendous. And it's really odd to hear... Uh, Nelson Mandela's this spokesperson. This is John Miller. Nelson Mandela's spokesperson, John Miller. Yes, and I think, look. Arguing he, that black people should go to the back. Well, of the in a certain weird. sense, the family was more united at that point. <laughs> the black family was very tight. You didn't see these baggy pants. You certainly would not have Chance the Rapper running around. I mean, it's a disgrace. So, I mean, look, fundamentally, we can have all of the seats in the bus, but ultimately, if we don't have the family, you have nothing. And I'm not trying to rape a business owner by forcing him to serve me. Or Nelson, excuse me, what? This is John Miller. I thought you opposed rape as a liberal. See, there goes the liberal media again. All right. They justify John rape Miller. when it's black. Thank you. Click. This is John Miller. Click. <laughs> um... <laughs> Hello, you. I'm Sam Cedar.
Looking for smart, progressive talk that is occasionally amusing? Well, subscribe to our YouTube feed. Subscribe to our podcast. Like us on Facebook. And just generally enjoy us.